Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we will discuss about how to eliminate left factoring in the given context free grammar. In our previous classes, we already discussed about left recursion and we have done some examples on dangling else. Please watch those classes and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, let's first understand what's the problem with the left factor what is meant by left factor so then we are going to uh, going to understand a real time example which we already discussed in our previous class eliminating left factoring it is a process of factoring out common prefixes anyhow this is not going to understand with this definition with an example we will understand so take an example a tends to alpha beta 1 or alpha beta 2 so what's this context free grammar says this grammar says that if you expand the production a if you find the input symbol alpha you can call beta 1 the second production says if you find the input symbol alpha you can call beta 2 here we are having a confusion if you find the input symbol alpha you are having two options you can call beta 1 or beta 2 this is what common prefix means with this common prefix we are getting confusion that's why it is this grammar is non-deterministic grammar we call it as a, it is providing non-determinism confusion so eliminating so we should eliminate this non-determinism another way you can say it as a converting a non-determinism grammar to deterministic grammar using left factoring this is how you can call it as a so how to do that a tends to Take the common prefix out. That is what our condition says. Is process of factoring out common prefix. So alpha take one more production a dash. A dash tends to now you can go with beta 1 or beta 2. This is how we are eliminating the non-determinism. Non-determinism in our context free grammar. Let's stay, come to our previous example which we already discussed in our dangling else statement. Dangling else problem. This is the ambiguous grammar which we have considered. Statement tends to if expression then statement. If expression then statement else statement. What's the common prefix that we are having here? If expression then statement up to here both are same so how to eliminate this we can write this using left eliminating left factoring means uh, statement tends to if expression then statement this is the common one then we are going with one more production s dash s dash tends to else statement or epsilon this is how we will eliminate the left factoring uh, taking out the common prefix so that we are having deterministic context free grammar decision is easy there is no non-determinism in this grammar hope you understand the concept of left factoring if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you